All right, so uh, in this video, we'll try something interesting, uh, like how to s how to set up um, uh, an A10, uh, right, an A10.io, um, um, this automation software on Heroku for free, basically. So it's pretty straightforward. I, I'm reading a guide and doing it as I speak, basically. Right. So there is one clip deploy. Let's see. Let's see how long it's gonna take. So that's one. Uh, select a region. Let's start this. So. Uh, a. And a ten. All right, so it's fine. Good. So, pa -pa -pa, what does it say to do? Okay, so you just need to invent a password here, and uh, configure username and password. All right. So I guess is here. All right. Let me just do that, and then I come back to you. All right. After you write down the username and the password, that I'm not gonna share. Is gonna ask for the encryption key. Hmm. All right. So how would you? What would you write there? Set this value to zero. Okay. So zero. And then it's just deploy, I guess. Click on deploy. Blah blah blah. Deploy app and start the installation project. This project will take a couple of minutes and we we'll start the script uh, running. As the installation is completed, the deploy to the Heroku text uh, will turn green with a check mark and an extreme right hand side of the screen. This is a confirmation that the deployment has, is now ready to be used. Okay, yeah, he's installing the stuff. Let's see if we can do it in less than five minutes. By the way, I mean, on AWS, it took me a lot of time to install anything, actually. Because I was figuring out the stuff, right? And, um, yeah, it was a little bit more complicated than usual. It's like, uh, like, it required, maybe it was three commands. But, yeah, but you need to configure custom SSH and, and all this stuff. That, I think, in this case, is not really required. Kind of. So let's see. I'll pause the video and I'll get back uh, when uh, when this guy finishes. Nice. Uh, so it seems like it just deployed it, and you just go to pa -pa 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 -pa. now. He's saying uh, click on manage app. All right, then let's me let me click on that, and then after clicking on manage app. Uh, click on settings, scroll down to config bars and reveal config bars. So, t -t 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 settings, okay, reveal config bars. Maybe I'll be clicking this and hiding it for me, guys. Um, okay, I just uh, revealed uh, there is a view like this, but I don't want to show you guys. Uh, but you can copy, you need to add two custom variables, right? So, you can use this extension to, uh, I guess, to copy that. So, let me see if I can do that. So, something like that. Okay, so I added these settings, right? And I think that was the last step. So, I can just go directly to my app now and use it. Let's see. Bang! Deployment in uh, how many seconds? <laughs> in like five minutes. <laughs> Fuck, that's so cool, man. Like, it's so fucking crazy cool, this stuff. So, all right, so then uh, you just add your email and uh, you can even skip the setup as of now. Yeah, skip setup. Continue. 
and you can basically you have an eight times to tap in like minutes. So cool, man. Uh, I like that. That's it. So, guys, if you had any question about this video, feel free to give a like, subscribe. I'm gonna be attaching this guide, and I see you in the next.